Okay, students, welcome to topic 3, orthographic projection. Uh, let's look at, uh, first of all, why uh, we need orthographic projection. The actual objects such as a pencil, a computer, monitor and a textbook are typically very easy to recognize. For example, you see a book and you can easily describe the book to someone else. Whereas complex three-dimensional objects are difficult to describe and can be even more complicated to draw and to dimension because there is just so many depth and so many sides. So you see in this cartoon, this person is trying to explain to the other person what a gas turbine looks like. Still on the topic of why we need orthographic, orthographic projection is used to change physical objects and three-dimensional ideas into two-dimensional drawings that effectively describe the design and features of an object so that the object can be documented and then later on manufactured. For example, if you were to see this drawing of a three-dimensional uh, view of uh, for a uh, gas turbine, it will be very difficult for you to understand what's going on. And if someone gave you this drawing, it will be very difficult for you to manufacture it. Whereas if someone converted the drawing into a two-dimensional orthographic view and labeled the details clearly in what is happening, it makes a work very, very easy. Let's look at orthographic projection. I've broken down these words, so we'll look at it in a bit more detail. Let's say, for example, in this picture here, we see a man standing. That man is the object. Well, the shadow of the man is projected on the ground. And let's say the shadow is the projected image and the ground is the plane. Similar to the shadow and the object, auto means we will be looking at uh, how we can project the image onto planes for various 3D objects. Now le let's look at what ortho means. Ortho means perpendicular and orthographic means an image at 90 degrees. So orthographic projection basically means the projection of an image onto a plane at 90 degrees. Orthographic projections are views projected on planes that are placed at 90 degrees to each other that is the vertical and the horizontal plane. The end result is that the object is fully described in two-dimensional views. For example, if you have a chair, I have made out a three-dimensional view and want to get it manufactured, you would then transfer it into a set of three views which fully describe the object 